Hi, everybody. Welcome back to the Monday Sports Page. We start with the Olympics. In February, the 2018 Winter Games were held in Pyeongchang, South Korea. Thomas Hong from right here in Laurel and the University of Maryland competed in short track speed skating for Team USA. He stopped by CTV to talk about his journey from the U.S. trials to the Winter Olympics. The trials were, wow, it feels so long ago already, but they were back in December. Um, you know, I just, we kind of going into that weekend, we kind of knew that um, if I just raced my race, um, I would be on the team. Uh, unfortunately for me, I would make it to the A finals and make mistakes and get myself penalized from the race. Um, but luckily for me, despite those mistakes, um, uh, I was able to pull through um, with all my friends and family like supporting me. And I was, I was just so relieved to make the team. You get off the plane in Pyeongchang. Talk about the experience when you realize, hey, I'm a U.S. Olympian, I'm in Korea. Yeah, the, as soon as we, we actually landed in Seoul or Incheon, um, the, the huge hub over there is in Incheon. And we, the, so the U.S. team gathered at a, a hotel um, right across from the airport and they had us go through team processing there. And e even just like the first few hours, they brought in former Olympians to, to speak to us about what this moment is and what it meant to, to represent our country. And that's when I really realized, oh, I'm here for, I'm here, I'm an Olympian, I'm here for a purpose, I'm here to represent. And it was, it was a really good feeling. And then you march in the opening ceremonies, you know, what was that like? That was, that was amazing. Um, first of all, it was freezing cold. Um, they gave us those, uh, the Ralph Lauren uh, heated jackets, and it was really nice, but at the same time, I was super cold. But while we are marching, we didn't feel any of that because um, the energy in, in our, in our uh, delegation felt, it was just so loud and bright, and it was amazing. You had your 500 meter. Uh, take me through that experience. Yeah, um, so the 500 meter is one of my stronger races, which is why I qualified for it um, at the games. But... Unfortunately for me, um, I was paired with a North Korean skater who happened to fall um, after the first, uh, well, in the first turn. And uh, it was after the point where they can't restart, restart the race anymore. And it was deemed as incidental contact. So um, my race was pretty much over at that point. Um, I tried to finish it out the best I can, but uh, there was no chance for me to really move on to the next round. But you weren't done because you came back to race in the 5,000, you know, final again. Uh, and then you get back on the ice. What, what was it like? Yeah, um, you know, just being there for that because we were there for a month. And, um, you know, there, there were some lows and there were some there was incredible highs. Uh, we just kind of realized that you have to forget about your lows. And we got back on the ice for the, the B final and in the men's relay. And the way the Olympics works is if, if teams in the A final get disqualified, there's a, there's a possibility for us to get a medal. Um, we knew that that was on the line. We went out there and raced as hard as we could. We ended up winning the B final, which put us in a good position if anything were to happen in the A final, but um, you know, it, the, none of the teams got this, uh, penalized in the A final. So um, we ultimately ended up getting fifth, which I still think is a pretty good result at the Olympics. Um, and I was really happy to be a part of that. A big congratulations to Thomas Hong on his participation in the 2018 Winter Olympics.